Hello everyone, it's Tripti and today's doodle celebrate British actress Eloy Morris on her 68th birthday. Morris is widely recognized as a prominent voice of leadership in the fight against discrimination in Great Britain during the 1970s. Olive Erin Morris was born as T. Catherine, Jamaica on this day in 1952 and moved to London before she turned 10. A catalyzing moment in Morris' life of activism occurred when she was just 17 when she witnessed the arrest and beating of a Nigerian diplomat. Warm police has a stop on the basis of the such laws of the time, similar to today's stop and search policies. In response to this interjection, Morris interfered to try to protect the diplomat and prevent the arrest. As a result, she was arrested ahead and physically assaulted. This indicated, indicated Morris' determination to take action, and she soon joined the Black Panther Youth Collective to oppose systematic resistance within Britain. Morris took a leadership role in the push toward justice across many areas of society including fighting for racial equality, gender equality, and equator equality. After hearing protest and demonstration, she helped to found the British Black Women's Group in 1973. One of the Britain first network for black women, despite leaving secondary school with no qualification, Morris enrolled in 1975 as Maastricht University, where she earned a degree in social science and prioritized legally for issues like international students' rights. She also traveled extensively around the world from China to Algeria, which greatly informed her approach to activism back to in 1978. She so confused the Organization of Women of Asian and African Descent, considered international in reeling movement of four charge in honor of Morris' lifetime of activism. She was selected in 2015 to appear on the Brixton Brown, a currency destined to foster local business within the South London neighborhood. She served during her lifetime. Today's doodle future Morris apportioned on a well in South London surrounded by the local community, the Big Stone Pound, the future. Her was instructed to support, she communicate to fight for equality and justice continues to inspire today.